and until and unless you are talking about my people, exclusive. No, I'm not no person of color. Colored people are what we commonly refer to as white people. They have blonde hair, blue eyes, and pink skin. As a rule, across the board, on every continent, when you see populations of black people, you see brown hair, brown eyes, and brown skin. That makes brown people. That don't make colored people. When you look at what we commonly refer to as white people, European people, Caucasian people, you are looking at black hair, blue eyes, and pink skin. Red hair, green eyes, and pink skin. Blonde hair, blue eyes, and pink skin. In the same family. That's colored people. So, that's your question, Elder? Of course. So, what about the Aborigines with blonde hair that are black? The Aborigine. There are two populations of people on this planet who demonstrate uh, 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 blonde hair and blue eyes. Uh, the one is purported to be naturally occurring. That would be the people in the Solomon Islands. The other, the, the Aborigine of Australia, that is not original. Australia was a British penal colony. They sent white male criminals to Australia. So my brother. So now understand, if white male criminals are in Australia and you have white male criminals breeding, there's no white women. This is where that blood enters into an isolated population and manifests itself in a variety of different ways where you have dark skinned people with straight blonde hair, blonde afros, blue eyes with dark skin, straight black hair with dark skin. It, it, that is an admixture that was introduced into a relatively isolated population.